have, uh, like I said, the uh, Torchmark sponsor our event, so I'd like to uh, introduce uh, Pingping Chao and welcome her to give us a uh, few remarks. Thank you. I, uh, first of all, I'd like to thank CBAA for giving us the opportunity to uh, sponsor uh, this event. And uh, I just want to give you a little bit about um, Touchmark Bank. Um, Touchmark Bank was organized in 2008. Uh, so we are a pretty new bank. And uh, we have three locations. Our headquarters is in, uh, is in Alpharetta on Old Milton Parkway. Uh, two traffic lights east of North Point Parkway, which everybody knows the shopping, uh, the shopping parkway. Uh, our branch office here is uh, in Doraville. Do, uh, it does um, a lot of the Asian business in, in, in this particular branch. And we have another branch over at um, 120 uh, Abbott's Bridge and Petri Industrial up in the north side also in Duluth. Um, well, I think that I don't want to bore you very much about uh, a lot about our bank, but I only want to tell you that uh, we are very well capitalized and we are open for business. Uh, in other words, we lend. Uh, <laughs> there, are not too many, there are not too many banks nowadays that can say that we lend, okay? <laughs> and we not only lend in the, uh, uh, your traditional commercial real estate, owner-occupied uh, space. Uh, we uh, do warehouses. We do any kind of uh, commercial real estate, almost, <laughs> uh, if they qualify. Uh, and we also, I think that very recently, I think this is something that will set us apart from other community banks, and that is we do international trade finance. Now, not too many small banks do that, but as you, some of you may notice, uh, we have a group of people here who used to work for Summit Bank that did a lot of international trade finance uh, in the past uh, 15 years. So we are experienced. And uh, which means that if you want to export or if you want to import, we are here to support you and we are ready to do those uh, letters of credit and wire transfers, uh, your line of credit, we are ready to do that. Uh, but the other thing that will set us apart is that we have an award-winning SBA program. In other words, if you want long-term financing, say for your warehouse, you don't want to have to renew every five years, come to us. Okay, we could uh, use the SBA program and give you a 20-year loan, okay? So uh, we are PLP, which means that we made the decision on behalf of the small business administration. That means that we could give you a decision faster than most other people. And our lender here is, is Katrina is one of the best SBA lenders in town. So um, that's all I want to tell you about. Uh, tonight. So welcome and uh, we look forward to uh, doing more of this kind of event with you and also we most important we look forward to serving you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Ping. Um, you know Atlanta is, is a very global city here and uh, lots of uh, minority or ethnic groups uh, living in Atlanta and like Ping Ping said, you know, this branch office serves the Asian community and the, what, what, two of the biggest Asian communities are Chinese and Korean. Um, and we had the fortunate uh, opportunity to work with the, uh, the uh, Korean Chamber of, uh, Korean American Chamber of Commerce of Georgia to set up a partnership relationship. Uh, last Tuesday, we actually signed the agreement that we will exchange our, our members to go to different events uh, organized by these two chambers for free and other benefits so we can have a larger group of people and we have more opportunities that created for our members. So I'd like to introduce to you the president of uh, Korean American Chamber of Commerce of Georgia, Travis King. Thank you. Um, we had this uh, networking event just uh, two days ago and we had the same uh, signing ceremony with the Xi'an uh, and it was a wonderful opportunity for Korean Americans to work with uh, now uh, Chinese Americans. And also, as uh, Zian indicated, that we are really living in a uh, well-diversified uh, uh, 
uh, city, and, and Metro Atlanta is uh, known for a good mixture of uh, all different ethnic groups. So uh, I think that uh, through the internet and all that, that we all realize that uh, now that uh, the way we conduct the business is really in a global levels. Uh, and then I think uh, this globalization is really happening right here in Metro Atlanta area. So. Uh, again, that the uh, Korean American Chamber is very honored and humbled to work with uh, the members of the uh, Chinese Business Association of Atlanta and looking forward to the, a lot of uh, good and mutually uh, prospering uh, relationship. Now, one thing to let you know, I see that there's some, uh, uh, I guess, uh, participants are not really Korean Americans or Chinese uh, Americans, uh, none of the other. But, <laughs> Uh, that's, uh, that's why uh, these kind of events are good, because uh, not only uh, Koreans uh, or the uh, Chinese, but also other uh, ethnic uh, groups uh, plus uh, mainstream uh, Americans can join us and then uh, share uh, their knowledge and then try to promote their own business too. Uh, we as a Korean American Chamber of Commerce uh, of Georgia, that we also have members uh, of uh, uh, Big companies such as UPS, Coca-Cola, uh, Home Depot, they all joined us as a member. And also we even have the uh, city of Toulouse and then some other cities joined us uh, as an honorary member. We are trying to reach out to not only Korean Americans to do business, but uh, also many different governments and uh, business associations and other uh, cultural organizations as well. So <coughs> again, thank you so much. and then. Uh, uh, it's an honor to meet you all, and we look forward to a prospering uh, relationship. Thanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and also, I want to introduce you to uh, Andy Kim. He's the uh, senior VP of uh, Korean American Chamber of Commerce of Georgia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Also, uh, I, I was going to uh, do that, but I forgot, but uh, thank you. <laughs> uh, uh, Andy uh, is uh, serving uh, as a senior VP, and then he's been a, a tremendous uh, uh, force behind uh, Korean Americans to uh, kind of uh, you know, the, uh, break the wall of uh, uh, working uh, within the Korean uh, uh, community, but also uh, he was really uh, the power behind us reaching out to different communities and mainstream businesses. So he's done a tremendous job. And also the uh, lady standing right next to is Agnes Koo. Uh, she's Hi. one of our executive ambassadors. Uh, she's helping out uh, us to reach out to many different uh, folks like you. So thank you for coming. Sure, sure. <laughs> <laughs> just, just a trivia, Andy and I had a, a lunch at a Korean restaurant. And after that lunch, we signed the agreement. We agreed to sign the agreement. <laughs> so, you know how powerful that is to have a lunch together. <laughs> sure was. All right, be before I introduce you to our keynote speaker today, um, I, I want to have a, I think he brought some goodies, but I want to ask a, a trivial question uh, before we, we do this. So, he works for MATA. Does anybody know what MARTA stands for? <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Metro Trento Rapid Trans Transit Authority. Good for you. Is that right? <laughs> Metropolitan Atlanta Rapid Transit. Metropolitan, okay. <laughs> <laughs> just, like, just like the other day you did the human bingo, you were wrong. <laughs> but what we have, we have, I think uh, we have some goodies to give out. Uh, we do. Later. Yeah. Yeah, well, our next, our keynote speaker is uh, Marvin Tolliver. 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 Mm -hmm. He's the uh, Community Relationship Manager for MARA. Exactly. And he's going to talk about the MARA development, especially in this uh, Doraville area. And I think there's a, there's a community push to actually to put the Chinatown name for this Doraville station. Um, so we're, we're working with, uh, with Marvin to, 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 to get that, uh, that realized, materialized. So <laughs> welcome, Marvin. Thank you.